What's going on guys? Gabriel with Basic Car Guys here and today uh, we're going to be doing a little product review. Um, now I've been looking for something that like cleans very well as far as like wheels and stuff like that because I'm spending a lot of money on a wheel cleaner. Um, but I didn't really know what to look for or whatever so I decided that I was going to pick up something kind of innovative. One of my Instagram followers on uh, my detailing page actually sent me a link to this so uh, shout out to you guy um, now I looked at some of the videos that this guy posted it's kind of I guess it's kind of a new product or something um, or not really I don't know but basically this is what it is so this is the hyper clean uh, ultra concentrator ultra concentrated degreaser uh, basically this is a 32 ounce super concentrated uh, degreaser and um, it makes five gallons. <laughs> so the way that you pretty much apply this is, or you make this uh, essentially is, you put this in a um, five gallon bucket or whatever and then you mix it and that's it, you're done. And you have five gallons worth of degreaser. Now there's another guy that, that had it and he was mixing it uh, 10 to 1 so I'm gonna try it out in different ratios. I'm gonna try it out in the standard ratio and all that But I'm also gonna try it in the uh, like 10 to 1 and all that good stuff. So What we have here Is a bucket from Home Depot, of course um, And then I was thinking like oh, okay, well I need a spray bottle. I have a Meguiar's one, but I didn't really want to use it because, you know, what if I, what if I have a Meguiar's, whatever. So I picked up a couple of uh, professional sprayers. So these are pretty ergonomic, I guess. So that's one. That's two. And of course, I got to get this stuff out of the bucket. So I picked up a multi-use pump that I can like, you know, transfer the stuff out of here, put it into there. So, I'm gonna go ahead and and pour the pour the degreaser in here and mix it with water and I'll be right back. All right, so we have our bucket here. We have our concentrate there. I'm gonna go ahead and pour it. it smells pretty strong. It's really thick, well, not really, really thick, but it's pretty, pretty thick. Now I'm mixing my water with the concentrate, kind of like stirring it up and all that. I guess you could have put water first and then this, but it's easier like this because then it'll mix it all up. First off the bat, I can smell the degreaser. It smells really strong. I'm going to turn this up a bit. I am just didn't want it to splash uh, everywhere, so let me turn this up. All right, so one of the disadvantages of putting in the degreaser first, as you can see, is that it was gonna foam up. Now, I knew that it was gonna foam up, so I wasn't, I'm not really too worried about that. Um, but what I can tell you right now, it's really strong, for sure. It's got a pretty strong smell, so if you're gonna be mixing this, please mix it outside or somewhere ventilated. I'm gonna let the foam go down, and then we're gonna go back to trying to put more water in it, because if you can see here, the water level is actually down here and it needs to come up here. So, um, yeah, I'm going to let the foam go down and then we'll go ahead and uh, come back to putting more water. All right, so we're done mixing. Um, I mixed with the power washer wand or whatever. Got really foamy, but there we go. Five gallons worth of concentrated degreaser. 
Um, yeah, I mean, I don't know what to say. I haven't used it yet. So I'm going to go ahead and pump it into this bottle using this pump. So hopefully it goes good. We'll see here in a minute. So this is about maybe 28 ounces, I would say, give or take. So, so yeah, there we go. It's mixed. You know, I'm just gonna give it a good sh shake or stir or whatever to mix it up. And there we go. We got 70 degrees there. Doesn't smell pleasant, that's for sure. <laughs> but, uh... All right, guys, so it's actually the next day, and I'm gonna do this test uh, with the um, Total Auto Solutions Ultra Degreaser X. All right, so I, you know, after it's all mixed up and everything, I decided to try it on the BRZ wheel, but I realized that the BRZ isn't the best wheel because my wheels are already really, really clean. Like, I there's really nothing that I can show off of them, so. I have this guy here, brought in his Kia, spray down his tire with it, and his tire looks something like this. So as you can see, it's really muddy, this car's really dirty, I'm not washing it, but he's here, so might as well. And if you see here, pulled off quite a bit. So. And I am covering this with that black cover, so don't be alarmed. But just do another pass. Just obviously, spray, spray it liberally. No scrubbing again. And I'm going to do a test on the other side. So, no scrubbing. Let that set for a minute. But you can see it's pulling off. I'm gonna grab my pressure washer and pressure wash it off. So, looks like it worked pretty decently. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and do it on this side so I can show you guys better, but here it is. You can see the runoff, it's coming off already. The tire's brown. So it's definitely working. I'm just gonna spray it again. Oh, see, look. And now the the foamy is kind of turning white. It's foamy kind of white. And you can see all the dirt coming off. That's a good sign. So I'm gonna go ahead and spray this one off. clean I'll come back to it once it's dried up but looks pretty good this tire is not looking bad so 
I'm so I'm gonna come back when it's dry um, so I can see like what it kind of did so so yeah I'll be back all right and here's what that uh, degreaser came out to looking dry so it cleaned up quite a bit uh, without scrubbing which is great uh, I'm looking for something that I don't have to scrub too hard but I will say that um, to get in, to get into the crevices and all that I will have to scrub which is not a problem I mean I just want something that's easier honestly and this definitely made it easier now what I did notice it's corroding my um, my wand for the pressure washer so uh, so I will say not to use it on like aluminum um, anything like special coated mag wheels I would just use it on regular aluminum painted wheels um, for sure as a wheel cleaner it's gonna save a lot of money and time the little packet was only like what 25 bucks it makes five gallons of degreaser um, now I, I did spray a lot more than I usually do spray um, but uh, other than that I'm really happy with it so so far the uh, ultra concentrate X uh, I give it a thumbs up for now um, I'm going to test it on various things, engine bays, stuff like that in the future. So um, if, if anything, if you guys have any questions, go ahead and check them out. Total Auto Solutions uh, and Next Level Coatings. Um, they have a great selection of stuff. I was recommended to it by another uh, detailer. So yeah. Again, if you haven't subscribed, uh, go ahead and subscribe now. Stay tuned for more videos. And I thank you guys for watching. You have a great day.